What's up everyone? Welcome to another special off the grid episode of Think About It, where I disclose revelations I wasn't able to have until actually physically leaving society, being 100% cut off uh, without seeing or speaking with even one other person and, I, and not leaving my homestead for eight years. Today on Think About It, we're talking about fractions. You might wonder where my co-host is this afternoon. This is where she is. My co-host and little Faith are laying down the job. Our viewers aren't going to appreciate this, and I'm going to be the first one to tell them what you're doing. That's actually what they do most of the time. How's that? <laughs> yeah, this is mostly what they do. Um, she just gets up every once in a while to come and get pets and love, and then she lays back down again. If I try to open door and like shoo or push her out. She runs not only back the opposite direction, but completely to the other side of the house. And if I go in there to get her, she'll go completely to the other corner of the house. But if I sit down, then she'll calm down and she knows I'm trying not trying to get her out of the house. So she'll um, relax. And uh, But the moment I try to get her out, if she's not ready, Forget about it. She's like a little toddler that runs to the corner to her bedroom and and just so yeah. Anyway, today on Think About It, we're gonna get rid of fractions. Think about it. Welcome back to Think About It. So fractions, at least in terms of inches, don't really make much sense. If anybody out there has had any kind of construction experience and has worked with the metric system versus fractions, uh, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Anybody out there that's never had any construction experience or has only worked with fractions, um, you have no clue what I'm talking about. But okay, so yeah, let's get rid of them. I mean, okay, I get the whole thing about dividing something into pieces, but put in terms of inches, why change the denominator all the time? Like, pick one and stick with it already. So like, you divide an inch into say 16 parts, right? You got 1 16th. Then divide one of those 1 16th into 16 parts. It just doesn't make sense. That's why 10 and the metric system makes such better sense. In order to do that in inches, you would make a foot 10 inches and 10 feet a yard, and so on and so forth. Then you divided an inch by 10, so you have 10 tenths, and then you divide each one of those by 10, so you have 1 one hundredth, or you have, then you have 100 hundredths, and divide each one of those by 10, so you have 1 one thousandth, and so on and so forth. But sixteenths and quarters and and eighths and 30 seconds and 64 fourths and halves and and fifths and thirds and it just doesn't make any sense think about it again as always do not believe anything you're told think for yourself and question everything help me stop sending enslavement hit the like and subscription buttons below think about it